What's up you guys and welcome to Why Jets Just Enjoy the Stuff. My name is Max, A-K-A, -A, A, K, A, Max Merlot, and I like to drink wine. Today, JD, why don't you show them what's on TV right now? We got the World Series. Alvin Craig just doing his thing. Um, pretty exciting game seven. I mean, it wasn't too exciting. It was 6 2, but. Yeah. 6, six 2. But it was an okay game. Congratulations to the St. Louis Cardinals. Um, I'm happy for them. I wanted the Texas Rangers to win their first win ever for the club house, but it is what it is. Um, today, we are drinking a Chateau Coupe. I'm not sure if it's rose or just roses. I'm pretty sure it's just roses. Chateau, Chateau Coupe Roses. Uh, 2008. This is what we do for class. I tasted this wine already for you guys. Um, we go through taste notes, and uh, I think it's really helpful to. I'm not tasting off the top of my head. Oftentimes, I'm taking notes first to give you guys the most accurate um, kind of portrayal of what the wine is all about. So today, I already got myself some poured up. So I'll let you get a look at it here in the big old glass. Nice kind of uh, ruby tinge to it. More just like regular red, maybe a little bit of splash of garnet in there, a little bit darker towards the rim. Um, let's see what's going on in the sniffer. My sniffer's been lacking a little bit lately. I got a little bit of a cold, but I still try and do my best for you guys. I'm getting a lot of Britannomyces in this wine. Britannomyces, at certain levels, uh, be a fault. And this might be a little bit faulty, but some people might just like it. And I think that it adds complexity to wine at certain points, but when the Britannia Mice's level gets too high, then it just gets kind of smelling like kind of barnyard, sweaty saddle, band-aid, however you want to explain it. Um, but it's smelling a little bit like band-aid in this wine. I also get some nice subtle oak characteristics, a little bit of that cherry going on, um, a little bit of spice, but that subtle oak. Um, let's see what's going on on the palate. No spit bucket today. It's Friday. Um, I like the sour cherry right off the bat on this wine. The sour cherry is really is really nice. Um, you get kind of that band aidy thing also as well, that Britannomyces Brett, as we call it in the wine world. Um, nice strawberry character, nice earthiness, kind of these chalky tannins that I could feel kind of drying out my mouth, but they're not too strong. Nice medium body, nothing too strong, too bold that'll blow you away. A um, little bit of minerality in there as well, and a nice long finish. I'm still tasting this wine as I'm talking. I feel like the wine just coming out of my mouth. I'm tasting it. So um, overall, a good effort from Chateau Coupe Roses. Um, I like this wine. I wish the Botanomyces levels were down a little bit. It tastes a little bit too band-aidy for me. I feel like I just fell off my bike um, in first grade. I got band-aids up my arm. I could smell them, um, but that's just the way it is. So an okay wine for 15 bucks. From Ellensburg Wine Works, winejets.com. Just enjoy the stuff. Thanks for watching.